How we doing guys? Long go back again and in today's video I go over part 2 of my grapple guide. Now in this video I cover some of my favorite maps in the game like Summit and Nuketown which is going to be last on the list so be sure to stick around for that. And if you guys find this useful please don't hesitate to subscribe. I'm shooting for 250 subscribers by the end of March so if you could help me out I would appreciate the hell out of that. Now enough of me rambling, let's jump right in. Alright guys, Summit, my favorite map for the for this class, for the Mog God class with the grapple hook and everything. So, one place I love to grapple, I love to come around here, jump off of this so I get an angle. God. And I, now that I'm not actually playing a game, it's going to take me 20 tries to do it. Although in an in-game, I rarely ever mess it up. I come around here, you can grapple up onto this, you'll have all these people in your sights, wherever you think they are. So I love to do that. Another spot. Sometimes if I'm playing control and they're down there on the ledge, you can actually jump down to this and grapple right here. And I actually just hit a nasty clip doing that. I grappled and shot somebody right off this catwalk and he <laughs> flew off the edge of the map and then I land like right here. Killed a guy coming around here and it works really good. Sometimes I'll use it. Actually a lot of times I'll use it. This is one of my favorite spots to use it too. I come around here and you can just grapple right up onto that. And then boom. If anyone's camping there, if they're trying, if they got you on a spawn trap, you know, you come up behind them, and you just have full access to all this. And this is a good spot to be on this map because as long as you know where they are in here, you got them, you know, taken by surprise. And the only place you have to worry about getting shot from is right down there. So like, as long as no one's right there, you can be pretty much on anywhere on this catwalk. And as long as you got your eyes on these guys, I mean, there's really nowhere else to be shot from. Maybe down here. If you're standing right over here, but even over here they can't see you, so this is a very good spot to be. Um, let me think here. Honestly, that's about the only spots I ever grapple. I'll grapple through the center, just like every other map. You can actually make it all the way across the center, catch people right here. That's a real easy one. Or you could run and jump right here, and I guess you could use it. I've honestly never done this before, but I should probably try it. You can use it to get up here very easily. Just boop. And now you're in this spot, and this is a good spot to be. If you have an assault rifle, this is a really good spot to be. And I've actually never explored this on Black Ops 4, so there is a ladder. Can you get up from the very bottom? No, you can't. Okay. You can just only get up from... Okay. I was just curious. Because if you're already up here, you can even climb a ladder. It doesn't really make any sense, though. How would you even get to there? Eh, whatever. And I guess I could... Huh. Found a new spot. I've never done this either. This would be a very good spot to grapple. Holy crap. They would never even see you coming. Oh my god. B domination? Yeah. All day. I'm gonna have to try that out some more. The problem is I'm just never on this side of the map and most people aren't, you know. I'm maybe in certain game modes, but most of the game modes no one is ever running this unless they're trying to run a big ass flank. But that could work, you know, running down out of the spawn here. Especially if they've, they, they got a if they're on the B, B flag, you can just grapple right up there. That'd be a really good spot. I just now <laughs> found that out. It's not even one I usually use. And the last one that I can, that I'll use sometimes. This map is small enough that I will grapple out of the spawns, unlike most maps. But right here, I like to grapple, jump, and boom. You can just bounce off. You can just la smack into this wall, and then you're just right up here. You know, get out of the spawn quick. And yeah, that'll do it for summit. All right, guys. Jungle. Oh man, this is a fun map for Ruin. One of my favorites. You can obviously, when you're up here, you can grapple anywhere. And watch this. Oh. <laughs> Dang it. Not what I wanted to do. Alright, watch this. If you run, what I like to do is run and jump as far as I can. Grapple. Once you get a feel for how far you can grapple, look how far you can go. I literally just went from all the way up there, damn near, into their spawn. Like... All you do is mantle that and you're in their spawn. Like, it's crazy. I love using Ruin on this map. And you can grapple up right here, too. And then you're in this spawn, you know. Or you can kill the people who are up here. But yeah, this that's like my main tip for this, this map. You'll always catch me running up here. I'll run, jump, and then you don't take fall damage. 
And sometimes you'll bounce off the ground if you pull it too late and you'll take a little bit of fall damage. But then after you're done with your grapple, just hit your stem shot and you're golden. But yeah, that's my main tip here. This is the one I like to do right here. You can go right up to this, into the walkway. You can go from here to up here. Just hit the jump button, mantle. One thing, I, another one I like to do is run and jump off this just because it's so fun to do. Grapple there and then boom. If you're playing control, you're on objective. Yeah, this is a good map for, for a grapple hook. Alright guys, on Militia, there's really only a couple places I like to grapple. One of them is up into this window. Because if you come out of the spawn right here, you can come up and really catch people off guard if you come up here. Sometimes there's someone sitting right in the window you can blast with, with a shotgun. And if there's no one in here, well then you got perfect access to the spawn, you know. Self-explanatory there. Sometimes I'll grapple to the bridge as well. Just make sure, you know, wow, didn't let me mantle. That was weird. Make sure you check both sides. It's kind of risky jumping up in here in the center because you never know when they're spawning back here. If they're going to come up this way, if they're going to come up this way. If you're quick about it, you can usually get it done. And other than that, that about does it for the places I like to grapple on Militia. I guess there's one more spot. I like to grapple into here. If there's an objective here, like for control. And I like to grapple over here too. Especially if I'm using an AR, because then you got perfect. They'll literally spawn. You can watch them spawn right here if you're playing control or safeguard or something. So yeah. Alright guys, and on Seaside, one spot I love to grapple. And I'm coming right out of the spawn here. In any game mode. I love to jump out the window, hit this grapple, and then... I can get first blood on this map all the time because there's always somebody right here or on the other side right here. But if you just come around right behind here, boom, you're good. Um, that's about the really the only spot. Oh yeah, I guess on the edge of the maps, like I was saying before. There's a couple spots they are not really that important to know about, but like if you jump up here, if it'll let me climb up here. All right, hold on, let my jump recharge. All right, if you run and jump right here, you can. Sometimes you can catch people off guard here and control and stuff like that. You can kind of go off the edge of the map. I actually never really grappled back up, but that might be a good idea. Like, you could get really get behind people here. I, have, I need to do that more often because people are always running down here toward the uh, B on control. Or is it A? It's A on control. And other than that, there's not a whole lot of spots. I mean, you can grapple from up here, obviously. I would like to run, jump out the window, hit a grapple there. Maybe blast somebody in the face right there, or catch people here too. Um, let's see, the wineries doesn't have much. There is, the, I believe they actually put this fountain here the way it is, just specifically for grapple hooks, but I don't usually grapple to it off the spawn. As you can see, it's like the perfect range, like when you spawn right here. And then you can really get out of the spawn quick, but I wouldn't recommend it because then you don't have your... Well, okay, I have my grapple, but you don't have your grapple to, you know, use right here to get across the center. And this is why I really recommend grappling on this map to the tank, or like I showed in the beginning, onto this pile of stuff here. And yeah, that's about it. Sometimes, if I'm playing control here, I can grapple over this and really catch people off guard here. They're coming out of the spawn, or get behind them if they're in here. Or, I guess I did hit one nasty clip one time grappling right here. This is There's actually a lot of good spots on this map, a lot more than I thought. Come right here, and then I can just grab slam people. You. Or just shoot them. And yeah, that'll do it for Seaside. Alright, now slums is just slums. There's really nothing very good about it for grappling. Although there is a couple angles I do like to take. If people are camping in that center statue, you can actually get a shot on it right here. And you can really just surprise them. You know, they'll just come out of absolutely nowhere, out of that little slit there. They'll never even see you coming. And if they're holding down this, and you have a shotgun, <laughs> it's risky, but I've hit some triples and stuff right here, you know, if they're all running around this. And I think you can kind of do the same thing from the other side. Yeah, you can. So that's a good spot. And that's basically how you want to grapple on this map, is take those weird angles. Sometimes, like, like right here, th this is the way I'll grapple on this map. Because there's really no where to go up. Or if I'm just trying to get out of the spawn, I might grapple. Like, sometimes I like to grapple toward this car. Just to get me into the action for action quicker. This is, this map is small enough that I do grapple right out of the spawn some occasionally. Sometimes I will. 
But yeah, that's about all there is to this map. There's not a whole lot. You just have to use your angles on this one. And if you do, you can really catch people off guard. You can even grapple onto the statue. I guess this is this is a good spot that they'll never see coming. Go right up over here. They'll never see you coming. Other than that, you just have to really cut your angles, you know. Someone's right there. Just peek out. Shoot it. And you'll take them off guard, so. That about does it for slums. Alright guys, Nuketown. I've already actually made a video on this called The Only Flank Route on Nuketown. And the only flank route on Nuketown is over their heads. Right here. Perfect access into their house, into their spawn. Ruin is the most underrated specialist on this map by far, and not many people know how to use them. I've only ran into a couple people ever doing this, Need grappling onto these uh, houses. If you time it just right, you can actually land your feet right here, and you'll just walk right in, just, just like that. I'll see if I can do it. Need a target. Need a ah, I hit my head a bit. But yeah, you can actually make it straight through. I think you gotta take more of a flat angle like this. And then, shoo. Ah, whatever. But that's, uh, that's one grapple spot. And that's about the only one, really. Obviously, you can shoot straight inside their window. And I like to do this, too, if there's someone up there. Just go right in. And they'll never, never expect it. And other than that, the only other spots is from the windows. You can grapple to the Jeep out there, you know. You can grapple to this jeep right here. I have a lot of people that can't find this. I've killed people right there before. Oh, and one more. There's one more tip and trick I got for this. I bet none of you guys watching this know about this. If you run and jump off of this, you can make it all the way to their house. See how close it is to being in the in the like in range. So if you run and jump, you can actually hit that and travel all the way across the map just like that that's why he's so OP he just run, jump off oh, I hit it a little late we run, jump off, and boom just make sure you do it quick before you fall below there and you're right back in There, I timed it perfectly to where I can just walk right in and just keep running right through. It's, yeah, it's it's amazing. So yeah, that'll do it for Nuketown. And actually, you know what? That might wrap up all these maps because I'm not going to do the DLC maps because one, I have hardly any experience with them. They never pop up in rotation, although I could do a future video if you guys want to see because those maps are very big. And I have found a few spots on lockup that are good because of the multi-levels, you know. So if you guys want to see that, I could run through them. But there's actually one missing. Casino is not in the custom game rotation. So I don't know. I'm not exactly sure how I could do that one. Uh, but I could do the other three. If you guys are interested, I can actually walk through them. Or even play with bots, you know. And just find where I would grapple in a real game. Figure out all the good spots. Because I'm sure there's a ton on those maps. Those maps are very big and very maze-like. And I do know of a couple off the top of my head, but I just not... I haven't seen all the ins and outs to be comfortable actually doing a to, to full, like, grapple tutorial on them. But I, I could walk through them enough to know. So if you guys are interested, let me know. And I will see you guys next time.